Hi everyone, I'm Angelina and this is Blueprint DIY where we remake our clothes to be just as unique as us. I am super excited to share the industrial sewing machine that you want. Yes, I know you're gonna want it and I'm gonna tell you why. I am an upcycler and basically what that means is I take old clothes, whether they're from my closet or thrifted, and I remake them into new clothes. And the reason this industrial sewing machine comes in clutch for me is sewing through layers and layers and layers of denim, like this project, uh, this project, this project, or leather or any other thing, um, all the way down to just remaking t-shirts. This industrial sewing machine is a amazing so let's talk about why you want it all right so this is the cell right fabricator it is a full industrial size compound walking foot sewing machine and first off let's talk about the elephant in the room if you're comparing this with other industrial sewing machines the elephant in the room is that this thing is absolutely gorgeous like it is gorgeous like absolutely gorgeous. Cellrite makes the most amazing looking sewing machines, but then they back it up with the operation. So yeah, just hands down, out of all the industrial sewing machines I've seen, this is definitely the most handsome that I've ever seen. And I just had to, had to have it in my sewing studio. All right, so let's turn it on. When you turn it on, you'll notice that there is no noise. Not like some other industrial sewing machines where the motor is consistently running. This motor doesn't start until you actually start to sew. And once you start to operate it, this is what it sounds like. I find that the control Control of the foot pedal is amazing and it is essential for what I'm doing. And I have some regular sewing machines that are just harder to control as far as the foot pedal. And this one is just amazing. The servo motor um, allows it to be able to do that. It gives it great, great control like I was talking about before. And it allows the motor to stay quiet until you get ready to operate it. All right, so let's take a break from the sewing machine just really, really quickly. If you haven't subscribed, definitely subscribe. I have a ton of upcycling tutorials. If you're interested in getting into upcycling, I'm using this baby as well as some other regular sewing machines. And I know you're gonna wanna see what we do next. So definitely subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss anything. And also share this video so everyone knows all the amazing stuff going on here. All right, so let's talk about the meat and potatoes, the operation of it. Like I said, I wanted something that goes through layers and layers of fabric, mostly denim and leather. Now these particular sewing machines were, I won't say they were intended, but they're most popular among those who make sailboats sails and different furniture to decorate and to uh, outfit boats. And I just thought that that was amazing because if it could do that, then certainly it could do the things that I was needing it to do. So I've tested this baby and always my question about sewing machines and I've done other sewing machine reviews. <laughs> through layers of denim and layers of leather. And my question is how many layers can it go through? Well, I am happy, like amazingly happy to say that it this coasts, absolutely coasts through eight layers of denim. I have some heavy duty sewing machines that will go through eight or 10 layers of denim. So then I just folded the denim in half and decided to test and see if it would go through 16 layers, like 16 layers of denim. It has a knee lift and the highest level of the knee lift will let the 16 layers, 16 layers of denim go underneath and it cruises, absolutely cruises through 16 layers of denim. And oh, that makes me so happy. You get such a strong seam. You can go as slow or as fast as you want to. It goes up to 1100 stitches per minute, which is amazing, amazing. And you can do back stitch, forward stitch, and get the job done. There's a little lever in the back that when you move the knee lever over, you can switch the lever and it will keep the foot elevated so that you can slide in and out your fabric, you know, whenever you want to. Now, if you change out the needle to either a number 10 or a number 12, you could definitely go through t-shirt materials. I do a ton of t-shirt of cycles and like I said I know that most people get this to go through extreme layers or extremely thick materials 
but it does have the range where you can go down and sew through thin materials like t-shirts with the appropriate needle and the appropriate thread. The threading of this is not complicated at all. It only has, I would say maybe four more steps than a traditional regular hobby sewing machine. The other thing is that it has a bobbin winder, but not just a bobbin winder. It has a bobbin winder that you can wind your bobbin. Say for instance, you're getting low on a thread and you just want to wind your bobbin as you're sewing. Yes, with this sewing machine, you can go ahead and do that. So they will sew and wind the bobbin at the same time. And then when you're done with that, you can go ahead and install the bobbin into the bobbin case. It comes with a light and this light is an LED light, super bright, and it is magnetic. So it will attach to any place on this machine, this all metal body machine. You could put it literally anywhere you want on the machine so you can position it to get the best lighting. All right, so let's talk about price and what you get for that price. The price of this is currently right under $1,600. Get the all metal body sewing machine, you get the table unassembled, you get the servo motor, as well as a bunch of extras. When it arrived at my door, it came in four boxes and everything is clearly labeled. The instructions, you have the instructions as well as a video. And the video is on YouTube, uh, Sell Rights YouTube channel. At the time when I got it, my mom just so happened to be in town and she has dreamed of an industrial sewing machine for her, like pretty much her whole life. And so she was so happy to be here with me to put it together. It took us together about five hours to put it together. Now this is and then full, full industrial sewing machine. So my dad did lift it when we were at the end of the process. But um, I find that I am pretty handy around the house. So there is some drilling and screwing that you do have to do, um, getting the bobbin winder attached to the table um, and a few other things. But for the most part, I found it pretty straightforward. The one thing I appreciate about me putting it together as far as like the table and then attaching the sewing machine to the table and attaching the motor underneath the table is that it gave me a general understanding of how it operates so that I can in turn when it comes to adjusting the tension when it comes to different things like that I have a general understanding of how it operates and what's going on if they mailed it to you all put together it would definitely come out of sync in transit so um only you can make sure that that's all in sync you know when you're putting it together so i appreciate that and my dad thought it was really cool that this has like the oil pan from a car yes like he was like that's an oil pan like that's a oil pan just like i have in my car and he just thought that was so amazing and so of course i thought it was cool after that too but the oil pan sits underneath the machine and it automatically oils machine so you don't have to do that it's done for you so all you have to do is uh, fold the machine back pour the oil inside uh, close it up and you're done it'll automatically oil itself as you're sewing and it also has a measuring tape across the front of the table and a drawer that sits off to the side underneath the table and inside the drawer i have all the accessories that came with it and these accessories include one four ounce v92 thread three screwdrivers five large capacity bobbins a maintenance brush a seam ripper 10 number 14 needles, 10 number 16 needles, 10 number 18 needles, 10 number 20 needles, and five number 23 needles. So yes, I am absolutely overjoyed to have this workhorse in my sewing studio. It's amazing. It's allowed me to do projects that I have never been able to do before. And I'm super excited about that. So I know that you guys are going to absolutely love this machine. I know you want it after you've heard everything that it does. Definitely go check it out. The link is in the description box. I mean, I know that there are a ton of people searching for sewing machines right now. And so for those of us who do know how to sew, and you're looking to upgrade and I would actually recommend it for a beginner and this is the reason why. I let my son who had just learned how to use a regular sewing machine, oh, I let man. him use this sewing machine and there's a couple of reasons why. The control of the foot pedal is 
absolutely amazing. And it has a little guard in front of the needle. And of course, with my supervision. All right, um, But yeah, he went nice and slow. He was able to control it. And so if you guys are looking for a sewing machine, you know, this is definitely one to consider if you're looking to get um, something that will take you from now on until if you're serious about um, learning how to sew, you're serious about, you know, pursuing that as a hobby or even maybe into a professional career, then this is definitely the industrial sewing machine that you want. So you guys go check this out. I highly recommend it. I'm so grateful to have it and I will see you in the next one. Bye!